Hello. Let's start by examining this empty, so empty soda bottle. Is this really empty? Actually, no. It is filled with air. So, when you pour water into a bottle, the molecules of air that once occupied the bottle come rushing out. And you don't notice an exchange of water and air because, obviously, air molecules are invisible. Now, you might think that poking a hole in the bottle would cause it to leak. And it does if air can sneak into the bottle. When the lid is on the bottle, air pressure can't get into the bottle to push on the surface. And the water actually forms, the water molecules work together to form a kind of skin to seal the holes, which is called surface tension. Now, when the lid is uncapped, air sneaks through the top of the bottle along with the force of gravity and water squirts through the holes. So now I'm gonna undo this. And there you go. Louie, take a look. Take a look, see? The water is squirting through the hole that was there because air is exerting pressure on top of the water. So it comes out. This would be great to take along with you on a walk with your dog. If he gets thirsty, you can open it up and give him a drink instead of wasting it all by trying to pour it through the top. It won't come in that quickly. So, whoop, let's put the top back on. Eesh. Here we go. And we'll put the top back on. The water stops. But Louis still wants more, so let's open it up so he can have a drink. 